Good morning, good afternoon or good evening wherever you might be. Here I have a six page document. The document contains information about various planets in our solar system. So as I scroll down I'll see there was Mercury, Venus, Earth etc. The unfortunate part about this slightly larger document is that there is no index. So I'm going to explain and demonstrate to you how I can create an index in a Word document. Some people find the procedure a little bit challenging for, I believe, no good reason because I'm going to show you a way to create a simple index which will appear at the end of the document which can be used very simply to go to various pages and make the uh, navigation in the document just that much easier. Remember this document is only six pages long but you never know your document might be a hundred pages long. Now the key to the whole thing is to invoke the golden rule of all computing that is select then do. So I want to create an index which will show me the page or pages on which the names of the planets occur. So the first thing I'm going to do is to double click on Mercury to select it. Then in the references tab in the index group I'm going to mark that particular entry for Mercury and up pops the mark index entry dialog box. Word automatically completes the text here for you. It says I'm going to look on the current page and when you create the index do you want the page number format to be bold? We'll put a tick in there and say yes. Then I'm going to mark that entry. Then I'm going to close the box and what we'll see is that Word inserts the show hide characters here which I can turn off. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. There are good reasons to do that that I'll explain later. So home, turn off the show hide characters and now we look for our next planet Venus. Let's double click on Venus and in the references tab mark that entry for Venus. There it is there automatically put in there. We'll bold the page number format and we'll mark the entry for Venus. Now we'll close the box, home tab, close the show hide. And the last one we'll put on just to save a little bit of time. Remember you can go through the entire document but we'll just use the first three planets. So I'll double click on Earth and in the references tab I'm going to say mark entry, bold, but what I want to do is to mark all of the entries for the word Earth. That is, show me in the index wherever the word Earth appears. So I'll click Mark All. Now I'll close. I'll remove the Show Hide characters and I'm going to go to the end of the document. Control End. Because now I'll put a little heading in here, Index. And we might want to center align that left align the index itself and now in the references tab all I need to do is to choose insert index so when I choose insert index up pops the index dialog box I want to right align the page numbers the tab leader I want to be dots I have other choices there but I'll choose dots I quite like those and we'll say OK now when I click OK, there is my index. And it says the word Earth appears on all of those pages. Do you remember that we said mark all? But for Mercury and Venus, we only marked the particular page that those planets were shown on. Now when you have an index in your document, if you wanted to go to page 2, you're looking at the index here. If you press F5 and go to page number 2 and click go to, it takes you immediately to that page. So now we're looking at the uh, index uh, uh, method to go to the page that the index refers to. So it's really quite simple, nothing hard about it. That's how to create a simple index in Word. Um, you can experiment with other, uh, other uh, commands in the index box, which I'll be uploading a uh, training video on within the next short time. Thank you so much for watching, don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you next time, bye for now.